this presentation is all beta. Uh, I made up a lot of it on the airplane coming out. I don't really believe strongly in sort of fixed presentations. Uh, my propaganda changes all the time. Uh, if we have interesting things pop up on the, the Twitter screen, well, we may just take a tangent and talk about those, because it, you know, it, it's whatever we make of it. Let me begin with e-learning. About 13 years old. I'll tell you about my start in e-learning. I've been working in the traditional training business. We worked with banks for more than 20 years. In fact, all the big banks in New York were my clients. We were training loan officers how to loan money. Very sensitive thing. Ba the, the time thing <clears throat> played into this, as a matter of fact. It used to be that banks would take 10 years for somebody apprenticing, and then they'd be made a vice president. They could loan money. But uh, something called commercial paper came along, and it meant that banks could no longer just subsist on great big loans aiming on the golf course, but they actually had to go out to small companies and analyze, well, are they going to be able to pay us back? And there was only one formal training program to teach people that in the nation. It was when I and my friends developed with Wells Fargo. So we were very, very welcome. And we were, we were tied up with that. Business was good. Uh, in 1998, we had about 150 employees. We were working everywhere that people spoke English and had sort of American-style banking systems. And then the web came along. And I fell in love with the web. To me, the opportunity to marry learning with this great technology is just a no-brainer. I mean, this, this is going to happen and happen big. So I, I was a chief marketing officer in my firm. I went in, I told my boss, we've got to drop all this interactive CD-ROM crap that we're doing. That's not going to go anywhere. We've got to get on the web. We've got to st we, we had $4 million of one bank's money, and we're putting together these elaborate CD things. And I, we didn't have the bandwidth for the web. So he, he did essentially what a smart business person would do. He fired me, even though we were best of friends and gone to business school together, and said, take it somewhere else, Jay. And I took it to the island of Cozumel, where I went to lick my wounds and sort of recover from this experience. And I thought, well, I really believe that the web is going to change all of learning, that it, there are just amazing things in store. And I want to follow that. So I did, and I, did, I 